install GTA mod menu 1.25. You do need your book page 3. You need to install the game. First thing you do is go into, well, turn on the PlayStation and then go into multi manage, let multi man run. On your PlayStation like this, do not sign into PSN, nothing like that. Just click on multi man and let it run. Then you're gonna come over here to the computer. You're gonna need FileZilla for this. So open up FileZilla right here on the top. Right here, host. You wanna put your PlayStation 3 IP, and then over here, quick connect. Let me do that real quick. Quick connect. My noise has this. FTP over TLS. The way I fix this is I go into files, I go to site manager. Right here. Click on the first one. Oh my bad. You click on the second one and you want to make sure you click the very bottom one right here. If yours doesn't have this, all you're gonna do is right here right, click new site and then you're gonna put your IP and then just change the settings to what I have right here. Let me zoom in. Change the settings right here, then you want to go to over here. Change this one, put force UTF to eight click force and then you're gonna go to the bottom click connect and then you can see it connects it doesn't have any errors nothing else if it says this like this you're fine and you want to come down here to HDD 0 double click it you want to go into games not not the capital you want to go into lowercase click on that then you're gonna to want to whatever file you're gonna put it into the blues or blaze whatever the fuck it's called but it's one of these right here. I'm using this one right here. So double click it, US, whatever file. So that's empty. Because I deleted the eboot just to show you guys. I have the eboot up here on top. I'm going to drag it down. Let it load. If yours has an update file like this one right here, like mine does, you want to drag it on here too. Let it load. Boom. Okay, and then you're gonna wanna back out, not back out to the top more. Then on here, you wanna go back all the way down to the bottom, temp, go all the way down, and you're gonna wanna put the SPRX right here. You can, whatever it is, you're gonna wanna rename it to GTA menu, like this. No matter what it says, rename it to GTA menu, save it, and then all you can do is drag it on. Replace it, of course, I already have it here. Place it, it's gonna load up. And then you're gonna want to go to the top up here to disconnect. Make sure everything right here says successful. Want to go here to disconnect, disconnect it, disconnect from server. You can close this. Then you go back to your PS3. Multi-man should still be on. And then you're gonna want to just hold down circle and exit to XMB screen. If it exits like that pretty fast, and you did everything right. If it still says there's files being transferred and stuff, then See the lagging, or you didn't do right, or something's wrong, so you're gonna want to just do it again. And that's the little quick tutorial. So, hope you guys enjoy it.